Cornelius Pames Jr. could face the death penalty. He's accused of breaking into Marina and Eusebia Garcia's Slavic village house. He assaulted them while they were sleeping and stole valuables. 74-year-old Marina survived the attack but had bleeding on the brain. Her mother, Eusebia, died from her injuries. This is Marisa, a new volunteer from Spain. Hello! Calimera! <laughs> you have to brush your teeth. Las uñitas hay que cortarlas, necesitamos cortarlas, eh. One, two, three, two, two. Hi, what are you doing here? I have uh, six grandsons. And you? I don't have grandsons. Te he hablado a ti. ¿Dónde están tus padres? Quiero hablar con ellos, con tus padres. Nosotros no podemos curar a los niños, tenemos que llevarlos ahí a Cruz Roja. Pero si soy médico. Sí, pero jubilada, ¿no? Pero sigo sabiendo cómo poner betadine. Crees que lo estás ayudando, pero no sabes el daño que le estás haciendo. Marisa, se trata de que aquí hay unas reglas y hay que cumplirlas. 66-year-old Gavin killed Cabarello and at least two other women. Steven Cabarello discovered his mother's body inside her apartment, a telephone cord wrapped around her neck. We want justice, we want action. Cedric Wallace killing Lucia Mendoza and her two daughters. Jason Nightingale firing his gun on 61-year-old Marta Torres. She succumbed to her injuries. Marcus Wayne has been charged with capital murder of 41-year-old Jessica Garza. Daniel Chandler is being held for first-degree murder charges for the homicide side of Roxanne Martinez. 17-year-old Dewan Patterson and his brother, 18-year-old Demetrius Patterson, are facing second-degree murder charges in connection to the death of a mother and son. The duo planned to rob Alexander Garrido and shot and killed Diana Sabalos. 